When people ask me, why do I need to make a chocolate bomb bomb? I always answered, by the effort of many. And where do I get my recipes from? In my day by day. Inspiration may come from memories, experiences, or simply for creativity. This job is more exciting than you think. Everything starts a long time ago. When you enter to a cacao field, it's like being in completely full auditorium. The feeling of the leaves as they sizzle while they're walking. Watching the flowering cacao trees and the catanias in their different states of maduration, it's unique. The aroma of cinnamon, oranges and bananas completes the harmony. Checking the health of the cacao plantation and clean those who have monilia, this plague that has hit us so hard in the 90s. Choosing the Creole Catania that will be used to make my chocolate. Open each Catania to see the juiciness and flavor of its mucilago before taking it to the fermentation process. Look at the drawers of grain and see the passage of malolactic fermentation to alcoholic fermentation are happening without adding yeast. Only time pampers them and manages the change of pH and aroma that identifies our chocolate. Supervising the drying, refining, and counting of the chocolate is something basic, as well as seeing the future of cacao fields, seeing how it's being drafted by the traditional cut-off bee and enter into the new jolk, and safeguarding our cacao. I can't believe there's people who haven't realized the great quality that cacao-producing countries have. It's the beginning of all. The Mexicanity of downtown is unique. The colors, the people, and the tradition makes the perfect place. Wow. 
what better place to put our chocolate shop? We paint our chocolate with colors. These represent the Tejuanas of the ethnic groups of Mexico. In the workshop, we make the process of metamorphosis, but nothing serves a good chocolate if we don't have the artisans who made it. José Ramón tiene una manera muy especial de trabajar, ¿no? Trabaja con productos 100% mexicanos, con el mejor cacao, y, y eso motiva muchísimo a la gente que, que viene aquí a hacer prácticas, ¿no? Es muy bueno saber que hay alguien que pueda promocionar más su país, ¿no? Para mí el chocolate, primero, es un ingrediente mágico, con muchos olores, muchos sabores. Si uno conoce la estructura del chocolate, puede hacer cosas inimaginables. Yo a veces lo comparo mucho con, con la carpintería o ciertos oficios. Creo que aquí desde, desde tiempos muy antiguos conocemos ya cómo se trabaja, las texturas, el chocolate con el agua, etc. etc. In the workshop, as in all families, is conformed by members with different ways of thinking and attitudes. But finally, as one large family, we'll work from the same result. In the search of the consumption of cacao among Mexicans, now we have dedicated to expose drinks with cacao from Central and Southeast Mexico that accompany our chocolate. Serve the customers, explain the dreams, and make them feel at home. It's part of our philosophy. The success of a bambam is not the work of a single person. It's the result of the work and dedication of a team. From the producer that works the land to our chef chocolatier. For me, being chocolatier is not only to know how to work with chocolate. It's having knowledge of working at the cacao fields, the producer, the situation, and the elaboration of my chocolate. That's why we only use internal products.
Mexican cuisine is a popular subject for all of us. This is our moment. We must be proud, representative of what we presume as evolutionary Mexican chocolate. Stop thinking that foreign products are better if we don't believe that what comes out from the hands of our producer as the best in the world will never start a gastronomic development. Stop using creams, butter, and glucose to eat chocolate with water, with the pulp of the fruits, with the infusion of the herbs. Consume the cacao of our producers create. Only use Mexican quality products, how it was done before. Now you know what you need to create a new bomba. Synergy, effort, dedication and commitment of each one of us is to generate a chocolate flavored with Mexico.